So, to start with, I'd just like you to imagine, uh, well, I'd just like you to close your eyes, actually, to start with. And just get in touch with um, your body, your whole body. Just notice how you feel physically right now. And now focus on that part of your body that's been causing you problems and the reason why you're listening to this or watching this video. That part which is problematic to you currently. I'd just like you to notice how that feels differently to some of the other parts. Okay. Now open your eyes and I'd just like you to give that feeling, that part of you which is causing you discomfort, um, give it a number between 0 and 10. 10 being the worst case, case scenario, 0 being absolutely no pain at all. Okay and just write that down or just remember it for later so you can compare it to how you feel after doing this exercise. Now close your eyes again. I'd just like you to imagine that you're outside in a cold, in a really, really, really cold day. Okay, and for example, you're just standing in the garden, no one else about, but it's cold, it's very windy, cold wind, but you've, you're wrapped up at the moment, so the only part of your body that's actually, or any part of you that's getting any cold really, is your face, the wind, cold, icy wind blowing in your face. It's, it's not nice. It's not. It's okay, but it's not nice. It's not particularly pleasant, but it's a bit chilly. So what I'd like you to do now is to take off your gloves, or take your hands out your pockets, whichever is best. And just notice how your fingers feel with the icy cold temperature and the wind against your skin. So now your face and your hands are equally cold. Now I'd like you to take off your coat and immediately feel how cold it feels in your body, your back, your arms, your chest, your stomach. Now take your jumper off so that your arms are bare Maybe you've got a t-shirt underneath your jumper and just notice how cold your hands and your arms feel in your face and your upper torso. Now I'd like you to take off your jeans or whatever's covering your legs so that your legs are bare. And you can jump up and down if you need to just to keep yourself a bit warm but just feel the wind, the icy cold wind blowing against your legs, your bare legs, your arms, your torso, your stomach, your chest, your back, your face, your neck, your shoulders, your fingers. Now take off your shoes or your boots and just notice how that feels on the ground. Maybe it's icy or snow on your, on your feet, your toes, your ankles, that wind blowing, that icy cold wind blowing in your body. And just as it gets to the point where it's just too cold, it's just too cold, run inside your house. And what you're going to do now is just put a patch, get a patch, whether it's, um, a, uh, it could be a plaster or, or a bandage or something that you can stick over the part of your body that was causing you problems before and just put it on that part for your shoulder or your chest or your stomach just put it on that part and then step into a, a warm bath that's already been prepared not hot but warm because hot would be too much if you're cold like this but nice 
warm bath and step inside it and just lay in that warm bath. Notice how the different parts of your body start to warm up. All the parts except that one part that you put the plaster or the sticker on. And that whole area will just continue to stay as it is. As the rest of your body just warms. Warms back to normal temperature. Cozy and comfortable. Except that one part can stay cold and numb. And notice how that feels laying in that bath with the whole of your body warm except that one part which used to cause you problems before you started listening to this before you started watching this video and notice how it feels now numb and cold cool notice how it feels differently and compare it to the rest of the body compare it to how it was before you can open your eyes and just what number is it now on that scale on that chart 0 to 10 how does it feel now and how has it changed? And you can repeat this as often as you choose. And please let me know how you get on. Thank you.